In this video, I'll show you how you can upload and edit videos in Canva. I'll show you how you can upload videos, add transitions, and also add text. So let's jump into it. So first you need to go to canva.com and you need to create a free account. Once you've done that, you'll then be able to create a design and start editing video. So if you go to create a design here on the top left, you can then click on videos and you need to decide what dimensions you want to edit your videos in. If it's landscape, it will be 1080p, 1920 by 1080. If it's mobile vertical format, then choose mobile video. I'm going to choose landscape though. We're going to click on this one and I'll show you how you can then upload videos. So what you want to do is go to the upload section on the left, then click upload files. From here, you can go ahead and select all of the files you want to upload. You can upload them one at a time or you can select multiple then click open. So I'm going to upload these two videos. We can then click open. If we then go to videos, you can see these files are uploading. Don't worry about these. I already uploaded these before. So I'll just go ahead and delete these just for the video. Okay, so now we've got our videos uploaded. We can see the length of the video here. So I'm gonna drag on this first video and I'm just gonna drag it onto the first slide. That will match it to the dimensions of the video. Now for the sake of your earbuds, I'm going to go to audio and I'm going to turn the audio all the way down. So we've got now 25 seconds of this video. So now you can either trim it from the start or the end, but maybe you want to cut out a very specific sequence in the middle. If that's the case, find the starting point, click S on the keyboard, or you can go to this trim tool. I'm going to click S though, and that's going to split the video. We can then find the ending part of the sequence, click S, and now we've got this sequence. Now we can just delete the other two by clicking on them, clicking delete on the keyboard, or you can just right click and then delete page, right click, delete page. So here we've got our first clip, which is 6.5 seconds. Now let's add in a second one. And again, we'll drag it straight on. So here is our second clip. What I'm going to do this time is just trim off the end of the second clip, and there you go. So now what we can do is we can add some text. So if you go to the text tool, I'm going to make sure I'm on page one, we'll click on the text tool, we can then add a text box. And actually, I'm just going to add a heading so it's big. And I'll just call this Thailand video. What I'll do is I'll highlight the whole text and we've got all the text tools up here. I'm going to change the text color to white just for the video. I'm going to leave the font as it is, but you can mess around with the text, the alignment and the font. One thing that I will show you, though, is if you click on the text, you then go to see more, you'll then see effects, animate and position. If you click on effects, you can add shadows, you can add outlines, glitch effects. So these can be pretty cool. I'm going to make the hollow effect actually. I quite like how that looks. So this is what we're going to go with for effects. Now, if you wanted to animate your text, you can do that also. Then I'll show you how after we've done that, how to add transitions and then we'll be done. So if you want to animate it, click on the three dots, go to animate. And what you can do, you can add any of these animations and you can get it to animate in and animate out. So let's say we want to use this wipe animation. If you click on it, you can get it to animate only on entry or on both. So I'm going to click on both and it's going to then animate on entry and exit. Now, if we wanted to decide how long this text is, because right now it's just a mystery length, we don't know how long it is. You need to click on your text, right click, show timing. And then here you can trim your text and display it at the length you want. So now to add a transition, you need to hover over the middle of the two clips. And here you get the add transition button. If you click on that, you can add whatever transition you need. Let's add a circle wipe. OK, so now let's play this video and see it coming together. So we've got Thailand video, we've got our animation and we've got the video of Bangkok in the background and it then should create the transition into the second video. So that's a quick overview on how to upload and edit videos on Canva. If you wanted to go ahead and download that video, you'd then go share and then click download and you download it as an MP4 video.